Greetings, folks. Diamond Woods Trail back again in another video. Here to talk about this. I just got to watching this Love and Hip Hop Atlanta shit. Just got done watching the first episode. Came on last night. Didn't watch it last night. I promised myself. I said everybody's been going off about this on Twitter, talking about this on Twitter. So I um, let me go check it out. So I went and checked it out. I watched it today. I just got through watching it. And let me say, if this isn't the most ratchetest piece of garbage slash buffoonery slash coonery I've ever seen on TV, what the fuck? I mean, me and my sister just got to watch this. I mean, well, I want to know what the fuck. But, and people, somebody actually requested for me to continue to, to review this. Am I, so one of my subscribers asked me, am I going to review the new, the latest Love and Hip Hop um, TV show? And I said, I don't know. I don't really get into stuff like that. I really don't like reality TV. But I said, since I've seen everybody's tweeting about it, talking about it, I said, I might as well go ahead and check it out. But let me tell y'all about this damn shit. Let me tell you about this. We got so the, the, the people on this show. I mean, I, I can't remember most of their names. Let me see. I know we got this girl named Mimi. She's like the baby mama slash girlfriend of music executive music producer Stevie J. This dumbass. She know her husband. She knows he's not a husband. She know this dude's tweeting on her. It's not tweeting. Um, I got tweeting on my mind because I was tweeting a while ago. Um, she um. She know her husband switch. She know the guy. She, she know he's cheating on her basically, and he's cheating on her basically with this artist he has called Joslyn, who I will say though she's not that much of a looker, in the face wise she does have a nice. She has a pretty big butt. She has a nice ass. I will say that she has a nice ass. I kind of want to say looking at the ass a little bit, but and but there was a conversation on this show, which there is on every reality TV show. Um, she basically. Um, basically lied to everybody saying she wasn't sleeping with this guy, and but then we know how they do the confessionals and all that on reality TV. She admitted to sleeping with the guy, but when people asked her about it, she basically denied it. And he's also denying it. But uh, anyway, he also kind of um, he also kind of um admitted to sleeping with her during his confessional and whatnot. But this his baby mama, girlfriend, whatever she is to him. She freaking knows that she um she knows that he um he's cheating on her. But why the fuck are you still with him? Why are you still with him? That's what I wanna know. Why the hell are you still with this guy? Oh no, I mean, but I mean if I if it depicted on how this video does whether I review the show again or whether I even watch the show again, but it that's that's just dumb right there. Why are you gonna let somebody cheat on you like that? I mean, you know he cheating on you, why are you fucking still with him? I guess it's the money. All the dick must be good. I mean, he must got me. He must be laying ass a pipe. But uh, anyway. But then we got singer K. Michelle. She's on this show, and she talking about how she got beat up. Who most people say it's by he was by myth myth hits, which I don't know. No, I don't know how how true that is. I don't want to believe all that. I don't know how true that is, so I don't know. But she's talking about how she used to have a. She, she really hasn't been. wasn't really that had wasn't really that big, but. She's getting big from this show, but yeah, she. From I seen on Twitter, she's like she's throwing shade at a lot of other African American reality TV stars. She's throwing shade at them like the Braxons and whatnot. But K Michelle, you need to go somewhere and have you a seat. I said go, go have you a seat, go have sip. But anyway, um, she 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 her whole thing on there is a bunch of shit. She trying to get back out there as an artist. But anyway, um, then we got Rashida, rapper Rashida. She's on there. I mean. And they try to play off like all oh, these women know each other. These chicks don't know each other. These girls probably ain't never met each other in their life. That's what I want to stand by this reality TV shit. They act, they set it up like you, like these girls know each other, been knowing each other forever. These girls don't know each other. They don't. These people have never probably never met in their life. Anyway, then we got Lil Scrappy, his girlfriend slash baby mama. And his mo mother on there. And his mother is one of the most interesting people I've ever seen on reality TV. Also one of the most wretchedest people I've ever seen on reality TV. She's pretty wretched. I mean, she's on here talking about how she used to be a pimp. How she used to be a drug dealer and all that. I'm like, why are you telling everybody all this stuff that I mean, you used to be a pimp? How you used to be, pimp, used to pimp, be a pimp and whatnot? I mean, 
Why? This show just got me. I mean, I mean, it is all. It, what, what hurt gets me about it. I actually find myself rather. I must say, I hate to say this. I kind of enjoyed it. I know I said it was buffoonery and all that, but. I mean, I, I just don't understand. I mean, they make all these reality shows knowing people going to watch it, but I kind of find myself laughing at some of these girls and whatnot. But anyway, then there's, there's other people on the show, but I'm not going to mention it. I can't really remember them. But I mean, this is... How, how well this video does, if you guys show this video some love, I might do another one. I might watch it again and review, continue to review it. But uh, anyway, I mean, I'm about to get up out of here. I mean... I mean, what did you guys think? How did you guys like Love and Hip Hop Atlanta? I know a lot of people liked it. Kind of, it was all up on my time. Huh? Everybody watching Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. I mean, well, how did you guys like it? Did you guys enjoy it? I mean, just, just let me know. Hit me up. Hit me up on Twitter. Follow me on Twitter. I'm on at, um, at Diamond Woods 11. At Diamond Woods 11. Follow me on Twitter. Um, uh, hit me up on Facebook. Um, well, he, you can find my Facebook on my Twitter page. Hit me up on Facebook. Subscribe, like, comment, uh, respond to this video. Do a video response. But, yeah, that's about all I got for this video. This is Diamond Woods Trev. Checking out. Peace. God bless. And I'm out.